Okay, we've got one today. Jeffrey Allen Carts Incorporated. Jeffrey Allen Incorporated. We're showing the staff how to take something like this, which is off the course. It's a lease vehicle, a little bit of damage, a lot of fading, and turn this into a uh, a new golf cart basically it will literally look like a new cart should add two or three hundred dollars in value and we're also using this one for the trade show so we're going to detail straight down the middle and then hand it back to Jeffrey Allen after the show so there guys can complete and uh, we'll show them the process so Robert the shop manager really gave us a challenge today and rightly so, this will be our trade show demo vehicle. Uh, we're going to detail exactly half of this vehicle for the trade show and uh, showing the staff as well how to do so here at the shop at Jeffrey Allen. First step, satin and black. We're going to reseal all our plastics, our flooring, our trim, our tires with black. We are going to use uh, also use black on this frame since it is a porous, texturized, painted surface black on the steering we'll probably use cart or cart polish on that polished metal and on this body panel our cart product there is our cart product and this one is very much a challenge because we've got it all this thing has got it all every kind of damage of course you've got scuffs scratches fading you also have salt damage and we have a slight bit of white overspray so a lot to correct and uh, so perfect cart as our demo cart for our Renew Protect products. Started. So one trick when you've got issues like scuffs and uh, heavy water spots like this and salt as well. This is uh, a four-year lease off of a course somewhere near a golf, uh, excuse me, somewhere near the ocean. So one trick, which the same trick we use for the vinyl seats to clean the vinyl seats, these little magic erasers, high density foam a little of the cart polish compound or your favorite compound polish product so what we're doing is giving ourselves a little advantage and taking down these water spots and then we will buff this one's in such poor condition after four years of hard water and salt and sun so we're giving ourselves a little advantage here as you can see we're taking down that surface and taking the scuffs out and the uh, hard water spots before we buff it. Okay. So the trick for vinyl, <clears throat> of course, vinyl is porous, which is why it just mildews and it just literally holds the dirt. So a cleaning sponge, this is a dense cell count uh, foam or called a magic eraser. So this with a little bit of a uh, detergent and or some ammonia you can pull the dirt out of these the porous surface and we're going to seal that with satin as you will see in a moment so that once it's sealed that porous surface will no longer be porous it will no longer hold on to the dirt and the mold and mildew 
it will stay much cleaner and require much less effort in the future and of course maintain value. finished product on display fully restored well 50% that is let's see if the lighting is adequate to pick up that difference there you go Not only does it not last, but it'll say, this is another one I've got. Right here. 